Hi guys, back for another video. This time we're looking at dynamic up body day. So today we're going to start off with some banded axle bench, which is a really good way of working the triceps, so it's dynamic, so we're going speed. Three sets of ten, we're going for uh, we're going to do some incline, close grip bench, uh, and then we're going to the accessories. So we've got my British team powerlifting kit on today, which we're going to get excited for Europe coming up in a couple of weeks. Um, and then we have still got these hats and stuff coming in the some trainers on soon, so if you're interested in that, do let me know. And now on. Speed bench done on the axle, which is really good. Um, if you're wondering why you use the axle for your bench, it allows the bar to sit a bit deeper in your hands, so it puts a bit more work into the triceps, so you're working from the triceps a little bit better than you would with a normal bench. Fairly good, 10 sets of three, 50% plus red bands. Very happy with how they felt. It's a nice different stimulus before we go to Europe. So next we're gonna do some incline bench. We're gonna go fairly heavy, we're gonna go three by three or five by five. Uh, depending on how it feels, so we'll get on with that and then I'll let you see how it goes. So that is incline bench done, we did three, sorry, five sets of three at 100 kilos. Feeling really good, just starting to push that weight up slightly, put the volume down. Um, we've got close to comp so we can recover a bit quicker. Uh, yeah, so feeling really good on that. Probably put the weight up and do it again in the program. Now we're going to go on to some accessory work. We're going to start with some back work. <laughs> So we've just done some T-bar rows, went to 110 kilos, did three sets of three at 100 kilos, then three sets of three at 110 kilos. Uh, again, feeling nice, just getting some heavier back, up back work in there, which should cover over nice my bench and my deadlift, help my lockout a bit, which just seems to be the weaknesses in my upper back for that. So just trying to get some heavy work in before we go to Europe. So hopefully I can get a deadlift PR there, which would be very nice. Uh, next, we're going to do some pull ups for our lap work, so I'll get back to you once we've done them. So that is pull ups done. We went for five, six, five. We've got five, 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 four, three. Um, which often happens if I do them, the like back workout, then the lat workout. Second, uh, if you don't have pull-ups in your program, really good thing to put in. Even if you do them banded, uh, really good for working your lats for when you're getting that deadlift nice and tight. Obviously having nice lats, strong lats helps keep locked in for your bench as well. As you build that uh, pop out the bottom, so yeah. I'm going to go into some tricep work, I'm going to do some tricep rollbacks, 5 by 5s and I'm just going to do some cabled hammer curls as well just to finish off with. So I'll get them done and I'll check with you as we finish. <laughs> So that's the last bit 
uh, done. So just did some tricep roll backs, 5x5, five 22.5 five, kilos. Felt really good. Did the last set on 25 kilos. It was a bit too heavy for getting the five. I could do with like a 24, 23.5 kilo dumbbell. That would probably be perfect. Um, what is it? I've done, did, and then just finished off with some cable hammer kales. The reason I do cable hammer kales is it helps stretch uh, your bicep out so it stops getting bicep tendonitis, which you can get from doing a lot of heavy benching. Um, so, yeah, that's the session done. So, I hope you enjoyed watching this video, looking at a dynamic day. Uh, this is the last dynamic block before competition for upper body. Um, so, it'll be uh, axle bench all the way through till the end now which is quite exciting something a bit different uh, and it'll be comp time so getting excited for that um, obviously if you enjoyed the video remember to like subscribe and comment if you're interested in the merch drop us a message and if you want to book a session uh, use the link that's in the description below apart from that guys i'll see you in the next video thank you for watching